Hi, my name is Jussi Medesma uh, from Finland. I'm a CEO of uh, Discmania Golf Discs and this is what's in my back. Let's start with the back itself. Uh, we have a really nice custom-made Discmania grip back that holds uh, pretty much everything that you need on a disc golf course. Especially I like to carry as few models as possible. So I'm carrying only seven different Discmania models. Obviously different variations of them, but seven models and approximately 18 to 19 discs. So let's check what I have. Uh, starting with the putters, uh, uh, 2008 we made a putter P2 and this is the very first run of the P2 and I'm still having that. So I've been putting with this uh, since then. And uh, I carry always two putters which I warm up and practice and when it's the tournament time I will only use one putter. Uh, these are actually the softest version of the P2 we have ever made and uh, I like to have my putters a little lighter weight so uh, like many of the other pros they are throwing 175s my putters are 171 so I have two identical P2s in D-line. I'm known for a standstill shots and uh, that's why I'm using the another version of the P2. These are actually prototype P2s I still carry. Our very first prototype run we made and I have uh, three different P2s for that. And I'm using these discs from the shots from uh, 40 meters up to 100 meters, depending of course of the, of the hole. And I carried three different variations. So I have one pretty beat up P2 with, which goes straight to the right that I like to use, especially in the very finesse touch shots. I have a, a pretty straight version of the P2. This is uh, my go-to putter at the moment. I'm using this the most. And then I have a relatively new one for headwind and windy days and if I really want to finish left in my upshot. And these P2s are all 175, so max weight P2s. I'm carrying five. Uh, <clears throat> since I'm throwing my putters up to 100 meters, I don't use a lot of uh, mid-ranges. I, I have three different mid-ranges in my game and these are actually not so much used in my game. So for example a normal round of 18 holes I probably throw a couple times of these mid-ranges. So I have one uh, MD2, the C line which is worn out and this is my straight to the right. This is actually a really understable so this is more like if I have a very tough shot or I need to finish right I'm pulling this out. My main go-to mid-range at the moment is the first run MD2 this is a new one, 180 gram, and this goes straight and a little left at the finish. Really good disc. And then uh, my most overstable mid-range is the Clo MD3 180. This is a, a disc that you want to use when it's a windy day or you want to finish hard left. Only three mid-ranges. Then to the drivers, uh, I carry four different molds. My main driver at the moment and it's been since then when it was released is the FD and I'm using the first run FDs most of the time so I have one this blue one is uh, my worn out disc this is uh, for the flip shots or even rollers if I ever need to roll I'm using the FD for that this is 171 so also a little lighter uh, then I do have uh, two first run FDs. Uh, these are the C-Line 175s. They are pop tops and these are actually relatively stable. So these go straight and a little left to the finish. So I always want to carry two as identical as possible for replace my disc if I happen to lose, which doesn't happen often. And then I have uh, recently added one more FD to my throwing bag, which is the 175 Jolly Launcher, so third run FD with Simon Stamp. This is actually straight to the right, so I'm using this for example in the low shots or tunnel shots. But anyway, these two are my main drivers, I'm using these quite a lot, so all the shots from 100 meters to 130 meters, if they are straight or they doesn't require a huge hyzer or anhyzer, I'm using this. 
then probably the disc I have used most over the time is the PD. Ever since we made the PD, I've been in love with this disc. This is the most versatile disc I think we have. And I'm still throwing uh, the first ones, the flat ones. These are almost like a Firebirds, and I have two of them. One is 171, which is a little lighter, uh, and then my main P PD is 175. This is a, a disc that I use a lot for the hyzer shots and, and the shots that I want to really execute well, a little S-curves. And then I have a Jolly Launcher PD, which is a, like more straighter PD, really good one for all kind of a finesse touch shots. Three PDs. Then, obviously, the PD-2, our meat hook. Uh, I carry two PD-2s, they are both 169, so they are a little lighter, but they still have the hard finish. And this is my sidearm disc also, so I'm pulling the sidearm, I need to use the PD-2. I, I really like this, this is uh, my main sidearm disc, and also the, the spike hyzer disc. Goes really far. Try it a little lighter plastic. And then, if I want to go real far, I'm using the, the Blizzard Z-Line DD2s. These are 167, 166, so lighter plastic again. Not for the headwind, sidewind, downwind. And these are really, really good flyers. Probably the best glide I've ever had in a disc. So, uh, for longer open shots, when you can have a lot of air, you can use these DD2s. These are, even they are blizzards, they, they play like a normal golf disc. So definitely want to try our DD in C-Line. So that's my pretty simple back. I want to carry one, uh, three to two similar discs with a different degree of wear so I can replace or adjust my shots. So that's what I have in my back.